lot of bugs, basically just a small version of a bird. What is going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Ninja Review. Today we are reviewing Atlantic Drift 16 Vienna to Budapest on the Thrasher Magazine YouTube channel. A link to this video will be in the description below. Before we begin, it is a great week to be a fan of skateboarding. Also, it's getting cold out there. Brrr. We have merch if you want it, a link to the t-shirts should be just below the description. So let's get into this video, rewind and play. We'll watch the beginning and the end. You guys can watch the middle on your own time. I fast forwarded an entire minute, hoping we could get some skateboarding in this 11 minute video. So, so far, 10% of the video is not skating. Maybe we'll get up to 50%. Uh, let's continue to fast forward. When will our first trick be done in this video? One minute and 50 seconds into the video, and we're not gonna blame the bugs. Nolly heel flip. Okay. Two minutes in, so now 20% of this video is officially not skateboarding. A lot of bugs, basically just a small version of a bird. Can I please get a single trick? Nolly heel flip, finally rolling down the hill. That's mostly what skateboarding is. Show it twice, rolling down the hill. He blames the bugs. Think about it. Oh, the car was going, the wind was blowing, the bugs were biting. Okay, three ollies, four ollies. What do we got? Tom Knox all of a sudden. Can I get a flip trick, please? Front side flip, not bad at all. Are we finally getting into the skateboarding section? Toe drag on the switch tray. More B-roll, ollieing over the fence, dropping in, rolling down. Didn't expect to get a flip trick there. Nicely done. Catches it a little bit primo, but we're not gonna complain about that. Come on, dude, 11 minute video. You know what, me skipping the middle, I might not actually miss any tricks. What was that? What would you call that, back grind, back salad, back feeble? I don't know, guy can't no slide, please make this video make sense to me. We get a no slide, small pop out. Chris Jones, I guess, little manual, popping in, pop it out. He had one trick in the video. Um, you know what, maybe I just didn't know what to expect. That was pretty cool, nice unexpected transfer there. Are all the Atlantic Drifts like this? I think maybe we have reviewed this style of video before, like this series, but it must not have been memorable. And that makes a lot of sense right now, because I couldn't imagine ever watching this video twice. Because I guess I'm not a big fan of bugs and buggies on horses and, you know, water flowing and a bunch of ollies and wall rides. Okay, not bad right there. Was that actually kind of like a wall ride shove? Nice one there. Oh, that was cool. Kind of seemed like a slappy into the front crook and then jumped over to nose manual. There was some real board control there. So this is the first skilled skateboarder of the whole video. And now we just have the inside of someone's house. No slide, not bad right there. Little firecracker revert. Little flat ground trick, I guess. Well, hand on the ground. Like, what do you want from me, guys? If they're not trying, like, are they making this for me? Tom Knox, no way. I just randomly said that name. Are we gonna get a bunch of five-star ollies again? If you don't know that joke, go back and watch the last time we reviewed this guy. It was a real mess. I'm gonna have to fast forward, guys. It's just too boring. And I fast forwarded, like I was more boring shit. Ollieing up, another ollie, another ollie, a back 180 off of nothing. Can I get something of substance, please? A sloppy switch tray. Push twice. Ollie's up, nose manual. Okay, I kinda, you know what, I'm okay with that. He brought it together. Please don't repeat everything I just saw. Same exact setup to the uh, tray flip down. Was that a switch back nose one? It must have been. That was pretty cool. What is this? Okay, you know, weird stuff like that. I kind of like Nolly Hill Flip Manual rolling down more, rolling down the hills. Please don't just do an Ollie here. There must be something going on. There wasn't. There wasn't. It was just an Ollie. Um, what do you guys think, man? I always wonder at the end of these if I'm being too critical, but was anybody like 
really excited to watch this and then after they watched it did it hype anyone up to skate because right now for me it's a lot of wasted time basic tricks maybe this is like a tour video where a bunch of non-pros travel around but it's on the thrasher magazine youtube channel so i go to this channel highly regarded expecting high quality skateboarding and we got just this guy the wall ride guy is all we got that's really killing it the wall ride right there back 180 Setting up fakey, fakey backside flip, landing clean, no tic tacs, pushes once. Another cool little wally. This guy's mastered the art of the wally and the wall ride. And now we're learning how to go fishing. I don't know, dude. Long tail side, heel flip out. Didn't expect a heel flip there. He's mad at the skateboard. He's about as efficient at breaking the skateboard as uh, this video is at entertaining anyone. All right. That was pretty cool, little front nose pop over, and I did notice this as I was looking for a thumbnail. This kickflip 50-50 that was praised all over Instagram has a slight problem that you guys all kind of already know about, but forget about. I'm here to make you remember what makes bad tricks look bad and what keeps good tricks looking good. Nice little jump there into the back tail. Quick feet, another wall ride. More statues, I guess. 11 minute video dude 11 minute video so here i saw this already kickflip grind not bad right kind of an impressive kickflip grind but for the banger of a video we would at least expect not to have this foot bobble right if you want to kickflip into a grind like this you should be prepared to jump out front foot's a little bit bobbly right here back foot actually has to move if he wanted to keep this in my opinion as an aesthetic trick he would have just nollied out but he doesn't have the skills, has to remove his foot from the middle of the board just to get out of a basic kickflip 50-50. And that, I guess, is what they expect us to believe to be the best trick in the video. That's the banger. What do you guys think? Have we come to expect more out of Thrasher? In my opinion, yes. But I would love to hear from you guys. Do you agree? Was this video lacking? Oh, I don't know actual skateboarding there was so much b-roll and i get it it's kind of a travel video you got to show a couple of the tourist destinations and show the vibe but man the skating here doesn't in my opinion match the level that we've grown to expect from thrasher and a couple of toe drags a lot of people were falling short a lot of basic ass ollies what are these guys traveling for maybe they're just going for beer pong or something and skateboarding's just their hobby but i was going to approach this video as if it was a bunch of pro skaters pushing the limits of what's possible in skateboarding and that today is not what we got this video for me is a 6.5 out of 10 i would love to hear your thoughts in a comment below what rating would you give this video did i miss anything and let me know even if you guys disagree also i upload so many videos every single week here on ninja lifestyle so if you're not subscribed you should be and i will see you guys tomorrow with another video kuna matata in the arms